situation too that you know you guys have let a few slip away at the, at the end of games and then this one got close and you made the plays you needed to make. Yeah, I mean it felt like early part of the season where we, we were actually were ahead. You know, the last the last six games or so, we were the team down six, down ten points, coming back, and making it a close game. But now, I mean, this is just, an open shower. You know, our, our playing ground, you know, we we're, we're making a right play. You know, today, uh, Mike, you know, did a good job. And, you know, I pretty much just let him take over the game. And I love James when he's shooting like that. And, you know, well, either I mean, I'm if we need the first half or second half, <laughs> as long as he get his points, you know, we figure that. Everybody's gonna, you know, uh, come together. Um, you know, uh, CJ's gonna you know, make down, knock down shots. You know, I happen to be good in the first half, and he makes some shots in the second half. But um, ultimately, I mean, when he stretches defense out like that, it makes it a lot easier. But has he gotten the whole team going, Brandon? You guys are 21 threes, I think, in two games. I mean, he got 11 of them. <laughs> Just shooting about 80 percent, so. Um, but it seems like it's contagious. Everybody's shooting. I mean, that's what it was before. You know, when everybody was shooting bad, I mean, it was contagious that everybody was shooting bad. <laughs> you know, no one was making shots. You know, James Harden was the only one, you know, making you know, two or three threes, but he was shooting, had to shoot like eight of them just to make it. So, um, like you said, it's being contagious. And I think it's rubbing off. You know, defensively, it's rubbing off. And that's all we can do. Just make the right play defensively to make one game. You said you want another crack at these boys. You know, what, what needs to change tomorrow to, to be able to beat these guys? I'm just our toughness. I mean, if, we, if we're able to eight, all rebound these guys, that'd be, that'd be awesome. I mean, they're not going to you know, score a crazy amount of points. You know, so you know, if we're able to rebound the ball, get on transition as much as possible. If we get a few easy buckets, I think we'd be in a great place. Can you appreciate what the atmosphere is going to be like here tomorrow, 7 o'clock, Syracuse, Georgetown, East Georgia State? Man, this is why we play basketball. I mean, I mean, being in a dome, I mean, we we used to it. The atmosphere like this is awesome. I mean, just, just for the top four teams, you know, to be there, you know, the last four teams, you know, playing in the East, I think that's awesome for, for everybody who wants it. You know. Thanks, Brandon. Good luck, Mom. Uh, Brandon, is there something technically going on that you are making shots, you know, settling in the rest of them or something? Is there, any account, is there any accounting for why you're making them now and you weren't making them before? I think we're praying a little bit more. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, I think James is praying a little bit more than all of us. I think that's the biggest thing right there. All right, one more in Georgetown. When you look ahead to that game tomorrow, you just said they're not going to score a lot of points. But what do you, and I know the answer by right here in your words, what, what are we looking at? What kind of game is that going to be? Tough game. Real tough game. I mean, um, they obviously not going to back down. I remember um, we beat them three, uh, two times, beat them home and away, I think a few years ago, and they beat us in the, in the biggest tournament. We kind of, we kind of in the same predicament. You know, I think that's my sophomore year. You know, and we look for revenge, and I'm sure it felt good for them to beat us. You know, so I mean, it's going to be a rugged game, but we're ready for it. So you would, you would prefer to be playing them tomorrow than Cincinnati? I mean, you're happy or not that Georgia is going to come out I don't care. I'm, I'm happy to be playing in general. But uh, like you said, I'd be more happy to play in Georgetown. That's more of a tournament game. I mean, this is why you play. It's like somebody beat them playing, you, and you get another opportunity. You know, and that's what we got. Um, I think it was more us. I mean, we uh, <coughs> went, went a little bit more one on one. I think a little bit of pressure was against us. Obviously, from them coming back, I think some mistakes we made were pressure, just having pressure on us. Um, but other than that, I mean, uh, one thing they did do was rebound the ball. They, uh, we didn't get no second half points. They had rebounds, six, six rebounds second half. So, um, I think we got some pretty good looks and we got pretty good uh, angles to the basket. I know I had a few of them where I could have got to the basket, but I was already pulling up. I mean, shot down to make it pull up, but you know, just also just making the right play. I mean, James is on fire to get to the shot, so I'm probably where we move it higher. 
but they did. They, they played tougher defense and they were able to rebound the ball. <laughs> Um, very important. Um, so, you know, it's something that we need to do. You know, get up on, get up on teams. Um, that's one thing I was telling for them uh, yesterday. We, we get out to a faster start. I mean, that's what we did. We were living like on shots. And, you know, everybody, was, it wasn't just one person. Brandon, you have a pretty good idea of the history of you know the game and in the Big East. How much more motivation is this whole thing, this run particularly for Coach, in terms of getting to a game against Georgetown like that for a guy like Jim, who's such a big part of this conference? I think uh, it's more important to him just because of the way they beat us. They beat us by 35,000, then they beat us by 20. So that's like two awesome wins for them. You know, if you're on their side, it's two awesome wins for them. I mean, we just want revenge. He wants revenge. You know, it means a lot. Just because, you know, them being in the top of the grass, you know, and thinking that we're not as good as we are. So we got something definitely to prove. The challenge going against them of trying to find Otto Porter and all their guards can pretty much knock down threes. What is that like defensively to try and face it? Well, Sparks, um, yeah, Sparks. Starks. Starks, 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 Starks. Yeah, Starks, he's a, he's a pretty good shooter. And um, Rivera Smith is a great shooter, so. Um, we gotta take away that. I mean, we did a good job on <coughs> Auto Porter last time, but we let everybody else get off. You know, um, he had zero points, but they had six three pointers as a, as, a, as guards in the first half. You know, so he got a little, he got going a little bit, but um, we just have to be just play a real balance, a well balanced team. We gotta score points. I mean, it's bigger than stopping them on defense. If we score points, then I mean, we obviously wouldn't got beat by twenty points. Why they've been so good defensively this year against you guys? Um, they're tough. They're, they're very tough. You know, they play physical. Um, they got some uh, big, strong guards. Um, you know, they uh, they play good, healthy defense. And, um, you know, they play physical. You know, when, you, when James is shooting the ball like he's shooting the ball the last couple of days, um, you know, what, what is that like to watch as a teammate? To see a teammate, you know, just really hit, hit the ball. The ball's barely even hitting the rim. You know, it's just all really hitting the net. Right. <laughs> and what is that like to watch that? It's uh as we hit as we hit about three or four, I just started laughing, shaking my head, you know. It's reminiscent of the Arkansas game, you know. And it was still enough to keep letting them shoot, so he hit nine. You know, and Big East, they, uh, you know, they, they stopped at five or six, but um, I mean, it's just fun to watch, especially for him, you know, to be able to do that and help the team out.